XRP can easily be valued more than $1 trillion. Yes, and that is not an over-exaggeration. Bitcoin just passed $1 trillion today. But why can XRP hit $1 trillion? For example, we just demonstrated our first offline XRP transactions. And that just happened today. Nobody's speaking about it. But this is huge. This is huge. Now, and this news right here actually is very interesting. XRP Labs demonstrate the first offline XRP transaction. Now, why is that important? Because in the case of a government or of a cybersecurity um, attack and everything goes down, how are you going to send money? How is everything going to stay safe? Think about that. Ripple, XRP Labs, XRP has thought about that. They're working on it. They're a generation ahead, everyone. The first offline XRP transaction, and no one is speaking about this again. This is important. So smash the like button, and again, join us if you want a chance to win XRP giveaways, everyone. I've emailed the winners, but some of them have not answered, so I might do another giveaway very, very soon. Subscribe. Make sure you are subscribed. If you've not yet subscribed, you're not gonna enter the giveaways. So do that real quick. It literally takes half a second. If you enjoy these videos, literally I try to get in five, 10 minutes quick and to the point. If you like this, show your support. Show your support because this offline transaction is huge. This trillion dollar coin is huge. And these deadlines are huge, everyone. What other YouTuber, what other TikToker is giving you this breaking news daily? Literally, I'm telling you from now, expect in the middle of October, towards the end of October for some more scary news. I'm telling you from now, just expect it. But what are you going to do? We know what we're going to do on this channel. We're going to buy the freaking dip and keep buying and buying and hodling and buying and hodling and keep going and working hard, having a business, having a side hustle, whatever it is that you do, and just buy the fear. When everyone is fearful, you be greedy. But there will be a time when everyone is greedy, and that is when we sell. Now I'm gonna make sure we all win together. When I sell, I'm gonna tell you. I have no reason to hide. No reason to tell you, oh, I'm buying when I'm selling, or I'm selling when I'm buying. I'll tell you. So join us again if you appreciate this. If you like offline XRP transactions, <laughs> like wow. What other cryptocurrency can say that they've done stuff like this? Not many, I'll tell you that. Not many at all. What other cryptocurrencies can tell you that they're connected with the Fed wire, processing over $1 trillion worth of value for this customer Volante? Not many cryptocurrencies. The United States government is in trouble and they need to print a trillion dollar coin to get them out of the debt. And a black swan event could be coming in the next couple of weeks. For example, on October 18th, if the United States cannot raise the debt limit, they will default on their debt. And that's bad news. That's very bad news. So expect some more scaremongering in the next couple of weeks. That's why. Now I'm going to play a video and explain what's going on. Now there are other deadlines coming up, not just October 18th. So make sure you keep watching. Do not click away. This video is very, very important. Now a couple things I want to mention real quick about the lawsuit is the Howey test. The Howey test was literally created in 1946 and they're trying to apply the rules from the Howey test onto XRP, onto digital currencies, which are only 10 years old. The Howey test is over 70 years old and they're trying to apply that same rules to XRP. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. Now, yesterday we spoke about how Federal Reserve Fedwire is running off of Volante and Volante is running off of Ripple and Swift. And Volante is doing over $1.4 trillion a day in settlements off of one customer, literally on their website. And they're using Ripple XRP. That is why XRP can easily hit $1 trillion in terms of market cap by the end of the bull run. That is why we can see a $10 XRP by the end of the bull run. 
Now smash the like button if you agree. If you agree and if you're watching up until this point, destroy the like button. Because just like the United States government can create a trillion dollar coin out of thin air, the XRP can be valued at multiple trillions of dollars. That's just my opinion. And if you agree, join us because we're going strong. <laughs> and again, XRP can easily, easily hit seven to $10 by the end of the bull run. Just watch, just watch. Now, a couple more deadlines before I play you this video. And again, smash the subscribe button and join us. Smash the like button is October 31st. Who's giving you this insight, okay? So the first deadline is October 18th. The second deadline is October 31st. And that is when the economic agenda has to be passed. And as we know, when Democrats and Republicans come together, there's always problems. And then the stock market and crypto markets go down. And then December 3rd, we might have another government shutdown. So this is important to everyone. In the next couple of weeks and months, expect for more scaremongering, for bad news, for bad headlines. Oh, sell your crypto. It's not a good time. It's a scam. It's a fraud. Expect that. Expect that. But why can XRP hit $10 plus and reach a market cap valuation of $1 trillion? Watch this video. Watch this video and let me know what you think about this. Literally, this is brand new news, breaking news today. No one is speaking about this. Listen. Possible solution to the debt ceiling problem? A specially minted platinum coin worth $1, one trillion. trillion dollars. It wouldn't need to be a particularly special looking thing. Here's a rendering drawn up by our graphics team. A it's literally the Fed and the Treasury just created out of thin air. Small platinum token that the U.S. Treasury simply gives a face value of one trillion dollars. And they just say, hey, it has a value of one trillion. So here it is. And then they give it to the Federal Reserve. And then the Federal Reserve treasure credits the Treasury account. So deposit. the debt goes down. It's at the Federal Reserve. Then the Fed credits the Treasury account with one trillion dollars. That wouldn't count towards the national debt. Boom! Problem solved. Just like that. And how many YouTubers and social media influencers are trying to be as honest with you as I am? And again, if you appreciate it, join us. Because I have nothing to gain or lose if you join or don't. Either way, we're going to keep grinding. And we're going to keep showing and getting good results. If you've been with us since the beginning of the year, you're up on almost any cryptocurrency that we're invested in. So, subscribe. I will see you very, very soon. Until next time, Mr. Mufleh, out.